to shape the future by helping to gather scattered Israel. In true High Five Live fashion, we made a video for our very sweet friend Corey and Katie and their new baby girl Kennedy. Hey, Corey and Katie, just sending love your way. So uh, happy for, for your angel addition to your family. And uh, I'm glad to hear all is well. Just wanted to take a second to tell you how grateful I am for, for both of you, for your examples of, of love and compassion and your excitement for the gospel and your zeal to, to serve others. Uh, you're an amazing couple. and. Uh, I just love you. Um, Corey, I miss our times uh, just going over to your office and, and chilling together. And I always felt so validated and, and so loved to, to just walk into your office and, and bounce ideas off of each other and, um, and just share things with each other. I, I miss those days. And um, we, uh, you know, being at different buildings, it's a little harder now, but. Uh, just, uh, just want to say thanks for, for being there for me all the time. Uh, you're, uh, you're super talented. Uh, I love your creativity and, and your zeal and your passion for the gospel. And uh, truly, Corey, uh, you are a man without guile and just a, a humble and meek servant of the Lord. Just love you and uh, just wish you all the best with your with all the joy in, in now and in the future with your uh, amazing daughters and your, your awesome family and, and uh, love you, brother. Hello, Andrews. I just wanted to tell you I love you. I'm proud of you. I'm grateful to call you friends. Okay, I uh, am amazed at the amount of time that you probably honestly never be known uh, the effect that you've had of goodness, both of you. So in this month of gratitude, I just want to congratulate you on your baby and tell you guys how much I love you and I'm grateful for your friendship. Hi, Katie and Corey. I just have to tell you that I am so grateful to be your friend and to know you and to have you as an example in my life. I am so grateful that Corey took a chance on someone not a scriptorian, but loves the gospel and loves to help share my testimony. And I can do that because of Corey. I'm so thankful that Kennedy came into this world to parents that she did because she is the luckiest girl there is. I was listening to a song the other day and it was an EFY song and it made me think of how grateful I am for the opportunity that I had this summer to watch Corey teach me a fly and touch the lives of those kids. The second that meeting was over, they swarmed him and came up to him to congratulate how awesome he is and to just get a moment of peace with him, get a piece of him. He touched the lives of so many like he still continues to and with High Five Live, he does that all the time. Um, even when you don't realize it, Corey, you do. There's those that know you. Every experience that I've had of anybody that has met you before loves and adores you and knows the spirit of truth and, and real, that your real intent of your heart is to share the gospel. Um, I'm grateful for that example that you have. Katie, the second you and I met, I felt like we connected and it, we knew each other. And it's amazing how in our lives that we get to reconnect with people that I believe that we knew before. 
I'm grateful that you guys both have come into my life at a time where my testimony could grow because of yours. My testimony has grown. I'm so thankful for all of the messages that Corey has, especially the pee face one. For whatever reason at that moment, dropping my son off at the MTC, I needed to hear that. They needed to hear that. So thankful for the guidance and the love that Corey has to honor his priesthood and to share the gospel as a missionary continually through his life so that I can be better. I love you guys. Congrats on this new baby. Corey and your sweet wife, I just wanted to tell you how much I love you. I am so grateful for our association. Congratulations on your new baby. Thank you for um, reaffirming my hope in the power of righteous men and women raising families unto the Lord. You both are such great examples of that, and I feel so blessed to call you both my friends. Um, I feel like your zest for building the kingdom and teaching the gospel and raising a Christ-focused family is so inspiring and what the world is lacking and I'm just grateful to know you and call you both my friends and sending love and prayers. I am um, so grateful for our association and Corey for you always communicating such support to me and believing in me and the mission that I am trying to serve. Thank you for that, being always a support and an advocate. I don't take that for granted. Love you both. All right, Corey, congrats, dude. Like, seriously, you are already the best dad. And, and seriously, I mean, you and your wife, you guys are incredible. And I love your family and your girls. It's another, another angel. So thank you so much for all you do for me, but then also for those whom you surround yourself with. So thanks so much and congratulations. Hey, Corey and Katie, just wanted to congratulate you on the newest addition to the Andrews clan. Um, say a few words about how the Andrews have um, uh, given a high five to the world or left a, the true legacy of love. Um, I just have to say from the first time I started on the team, um, I remember Corey, um, I remember your drive was unlike or very very few people I have met with a similar drive as you. It truly is a drive um, with the knowledge in mind from you that you love what is holy. And for me, that is what a true priesthood holder does. Um, I remember coming to your home and feeling your, the spirit of your home. And it was very meek and very humble and very loving. Um, and Katie was so soft-spoken and so sweet and I've never been that way <laughs> and I thought oh what a sweet person she is and but you two talked to each other and you communicated about anything and everything and it was just beautiful so your your partnership um, that you have created is is a beautiful model that anyone can look at and then Corey I'm gonna say I remember the first few times um, you saw your your kids came into the picture while you were doing a video and instead of what I would have done, you know, pulled them down off camera, um, you turned to them and talked to them and made them a part of what you were doing. And it was a beautiful example of compassion and love, true love, what the savior would do. And I remember thinking that I remember being irritated the first time and then, but only for a few seconds. And then, um, the next couple of times, truly seeing and visualizing that aspect and that um, Christ-like virtue that you have. So I just, I'm so grateful for you too. I'm so grateful for the legacy. It truly is a legacy that you are leaving behind and these beautiful girls that will influence and be mothers in Zion of so many more beautiful souls. So thank you. I love you. I love your passion. I love your love of what is holy and I love your hearts, your pure, 
sweethearts. Have a great day. Congratulations again. Happy Sabbath. And uh, love you guys.